Welcome to IBM Support TV, where we answer questions and share technical support information, hints and tips on IBM products. Hello, welcome to this short presentation on object server performance monitoring. The example environment used was Netcall Omnibus 8.1 running on Linux with a Windows 7 desktop. The main documentation discusses performance in the performance tuning section. This guidance is the base of any performance monitoring and tuning. The object server's memory usage is logged in its log file at message level informational. The catalog.mem store table holds how the object server is using memory. The operating system allows memory usage monitoring and you should discuss what tools are available with the system's administrator. The master database holds the main tables used for monitoring and self-monitoring. Master.stats holds data regarding the clients. The master.sm underscore thresholds table can be updated to set the self-monitoring thresholds using the administration tool. The self-monitoring top tables can be viewed or dumped to a file as required. The master.stats table includes row counts for the three main dynamic tables as well as the total number of connected clients. It is useful for spotting trends and abnormal usage. The catalog database has other performance related tables including those used by the trigger statistics and the profiler login. Catalog.memstores holds the hard disk and memory usage of the object server with catalog.connections listing the current object server connections. Other tables such as alerts.login underscore failures and the stats tables can help to identify other performance issues. The object server has five main log files for helping to identify performance issues. The object server log which logs the memory usage as well as warning and error messages. The audit log for user and system audit messages. The self-monitoring log for the login of the set thresholds. The profiler log for logging the object server's client usage. The trigger statistics log for logging the performance of the triggers. The Netcall Omnibus extensions have a number of performance related enhancements. Automated housekeeping which reduces the risk of performance issues happening. The return on investment extensions that extends performance data gathering and monitoring. The flood detection extension that prevents event floods from affecting the object server's performance. You can use heartbeating features to confirm event delivery and monitor event delivery timings. Some event types, such as problem events, can affect object server performance without being obvious and same P table scan performance. Ensure all dynamic tables have their row counts monitored and logged, so issues are easily identified. Monitor the system using operating system tools so that the entire system's performance is understood, not just the object servers, as the object server's performance may slow due to another process taking away memory or CPU. Ensure that the self-monitoring thresholds are set and event alerting warns the administrator adequately. Monitor the object server's usage using the master.stats table and understand normal and abnormal usage. Create custom monitoring triggers where appropriate. Monitor the system's CPU and memory usage and understand how the system behaves when loaded. Thanks for watching this episode of IBM Support TV. Please leave a comment with topics you would like to see in future episodes. Until then, stay tuned.